Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to quickly and easy reset your custom bin counter. We're going to be using the tool Galaxy Toolbox by Doki73 from Make the Developers Forums. Now this is quite an easy procedure, obviously this will require root, but it is easy to, to do. Now if you're wondering what this comes of use, well, uh, the, custom, the custom bin counter increases whenever you flash custom ROMs such as Cyanogen mod, whenever you switch kernels and so on. So uh, that is kind of getting on the way on your warranty in case something happens with your Galaxy Y. So um, if you have a custom bin counter increased, unrooting your phone might, might not help because the people at the uh, repair center there will find out that you still have washed your Galaxy Y and you have rooted it before. So uh, with this tool, you can reset the custom bin counter and be back to normal, as if nothing ever has been done to your Galaxy Y. So download the app from the Google Play Store and open it up. This app will require root, so just allow it. It will ask you two times. Then we've got a wiring screen here. So here it shows the current supported models. We have Galaxy Pocket, Galaxy Y series, Galaxy Pro, Pop Pro, Ace, dual SIM models and so on. So yeah, just take this box here and let me in. Once again, allow it root access. And here we are. Now, as you can see, this also offers network unlock, so if your phone is locked to a network, you can unlock it from here. But mainly we'll be focusing on the custom binary counter reset. So before we begin, I'm just going to show you in device information. My custom binary count is 6. So we're going to reset that to 0. Now let's go back. Let's head into the custom binary counter. So since we've got a warning before, I would highly recommend that you head back to Backup EFC Partition option here and create a backup. I have already done one, so let's go back to the custom binary counter reset. And as you can see, we have a simple button here, Reset Counter, that gets the job done. So let's tap on that. Once again, allow it root access. Custom binary counter has been cleared. Check Device Info menu. Let's go back and let's see in Device Info what it says. This takes a while, but yeah. Okay, custom binary count zero. As you can see, now I'm gonna boot into download mode and we're gonna have a look and see what it displays there. And here we are in download mode. So I'm gonna press the volume up and we're gonna see how many custom bin counts. And as you can see, it went from six to zero. So as you can see now here, everything is back to normal. Current bin, Samsung official, I'm using the stock kernel. I have zero bin counts and now if I use an unroot procedure on my Galaxy Y, I'll restore it back to normal as if I never rooted it and as if I never installed a custom ROM in my life on the Galaxy Y. So that's pretty much it everyone, I hope you found this video useful, if you did, if you want to see more videos, please hit the subscribe button on the right side and don't forget that there is an upcoming giveaway in the 200 video. Once again, thank for watching everyone and I'll see you next time, goodbye.